By the end of this video, you're going to learn how to clean and remove the errors in your Windows registry. So first of all, what is the Windows registry? It's basically a large database stored on the operating system that stores lots of information and settings to do with the operating system itself and the programs that you run on it. So if these settings are changed incorrectly, it can actually cause a lot of corruption and issues for the operating system and the programs running on it. It could also be a security breach as well, which can make it even more serious. So it's important that you keep it clean and healthy for security and performance purposes. So in order to clean the Windows registry, we're going to be downloading a trusted program called CCleaner. There will be a link below where you can find more information. And when you first load up, you're going to be greeted with this cleaning section. Now CCleaner is a multifunction utility, and as you see on the cleaning section here, we can actually remove a lot of junk files, temporary files, a lot of things from our windows and applications, where you can actually analyze and run the cleaner within seconds or minutes, depends on how many issues you have. Now today, we're not going to be focusing on this, we're going to be focusing on the registry part. And all we need to do is select all of the registry types we want to scan through. So we want to scan through all of them, for example, and we're going to click scan for issues. Now, most of the time you're going to have a big list of issues if you haven't actually done this before. So just give it a couple of seconds to a couple of minutes, depends on how big the registry is. Now, as you can see, it's only listed one problem for me because I've not long scanned this registry a couple of days ago, but for you, it's going to have a big list if you haven't done it before. And fortunately, this ain't too serious, it's only an unused file extension, which is quite unnecessary to be in the registry, so I'm going to get rid of it anyway. So once it's fully scanned, you want to select all the problems you want to resolve, and then you want to click on Fix Selected Issues. Now here it's going to prompt you to back up the registry before making changes, so we're going to do that by clicking Yes and saving the backup anywhere that's memorable. So I'm going to save in my documents, click Save, and here we're just going to give us a file in a box saying do you want to fix the issues. So you're going to click on that box here, and that's it. Now obviously it depends on the more issues you have, the longer it would take. It may take anywhere from a couple of seconds to a couple of minutes, so just let it do its thing. And that is all you need to do to clean up and fix the errors in your Windows registry. Again, there will be a link below to download this utility, and it will tell you all the information you need. Like I say, this is a multifunction utility, so there's all sorts of different tools here where you can uninstall programs, change startup programs, you could even do disk cleanups. So if this video is helpful, please leave a like and pass it on to someone who may find it helpful as well. If you do have any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. So thank you so much for watching and have a good day.